2011 Panini Threads football. Let's get to the random. We got some great stuff coming up. Some Bowman. Some different breaks around here. Seven times through for the owner names. 2011. So we're looking for Calvin Johnson rookies, burrito relics, all kinds of different things. <laughs> Here we go. So here's the lucky number seven, and that is our first list gone through. And so we're going to see. Well, Lions are going to be really big, of course. And so are the, I think, A.J. Green's rookies here. Bengals could be big. Um... There's some other great 2011 rookies I'm leaving out, but oh well. Seven times here. I can't think of who they are right now. And for some reason, I missed a team. Let me get back here. So, you know, I missed the team on the copy and paste there, the Redskins. There we go. Seven times through. Lucky number seven. Also, there there's legends in here, so it's not just um, rookies that we're looking for, but also legends autographs as well. So any team can be a good team, you know it. So you can see your team in the break right now. All right, so we're going to sort out, uh, we're going to get this alphabetized and get it ripping. Good luck, everybody, in the box break. I'm having trouble remembering the rookies from 2011. I really can't remember. I think Calvin Johnson, but I'm really not even sure about him. 2011. Well, you can see Mark Ingram. I mean, maybe his rookie cards in here. That'd be a good one to get. Four autographs or memorabilia. Well, that ought to help. We got a checklist right here. Rookie collection materials. Okay, Cam Newton, Mark Ingram, Randall Cobb. Okay, Shane Vereen, yep. Kyle Rudolph, yep, okay. A.J. Green's a rookie, yes. Kaepernick, Julio Jones. Okay, so Atlanta, Detroit, Carolina, New Orleans. Yes. Yes, Von Miller, also with the Broncos. All right. And there are no trades. Yeah, Julio Jones, rookie. That's a big one there, man. Leo Jones. Megatron. I think uh I think Dak Pre no 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 not Prescott.
So we're still looking for that first hit. And I think it's coming out of this pack. What is this? It's a Tony Gonzalez Atlanta Falcons relic. Nice. Tony G, one of the best tight ends to ever play the game. You've got a thread scar. Number 299. One of the best tight ends ever. No doubt. I can't, I mean, there's just no question. He is in the top five. You have to put him there. Randy Moss and his Titans. A Brian Hartline from Miami. I remember him. I'm a Dolphins fan, so yeah, I remember Hartline. <laughs> Oh, yeah, Chad Henney. Oh, yeah, there's Cadillac. Oh, what is this Ancline Bolden card? What is this? Is that a frame? Look at that. Baltimore. Nice. 3550 frame. We got a couple framed Boldens. Oh my gosh. These are really nice. This one's number 200. So back to back Boldens for Baltimore. <laughs> nice. That was pretty cool. It was a Tim Tebow. We, so we just passed a Tim Tebow. What is this rookie class? Cecil Shorts. He's still relevant in today's world of football. Cecil Shorts, rookie. I believe he's still relevant anyway. Uh, he had a good run there with uh, Jacksonville. I know that. And that's really cool. So, Corey, nice, great big relic card. I believe that's hit number two. Uh, yeah, right. Jacksonville, Corey. Let me see. Yeah, the Atlanta Falcons was hit number one with Tony G. So... We've got two more hits left in the break. Two hits left in the rip. And that's probably numbered. Yep, number 31 of 100. There's a Calvin Johnson. So this is his rookie card. So I'm going to set that out for anyone. For the... Uh, for the Detroit owner. Nice going there. There's a Calvin Johnson rookie art. Doesn't say rookie on it. But this was his 2011 rookie year. So it is, it is, it should be considered a rookie card. Deion Branch. Uh, that is nice. Number two, uh, 142. Deion Branch for the Patriots.
Peyton Hillis. <laughs> oh, I hadn't I hadn't said his name in a long time. Peyton Hillis. <laughs> he had a couple good years, man. He went. He was with the Broncos, and it was like anybody the Broncos had on their team running the ball was going to be a beast. And Peyton Hillis for a year with the Broncos was unstoppable. Here's a nice Dustin Keller. Then they traded him to Cleveland, and he just kind of faded away into obscurity. Peyton Hillis. He was good. I mean, he he was really good. I mean, but it was like anybody, anybody, it was Denver would just plug and play for running back position. Uh, Shanahan is, is one of those guys. And still, the 49ers are like that uh, with uh, the other Shanahan. Okay, not not Calvin Johnson's rookie year. Okay, I thought it might have been, but I guess you're right. Here's Alden Smith. That's a really nice rookie card there. Uh, 238 of 25. But the, the Shanahan's, anytime they're coaching, man, they always have a good running system. They got a good running scheme. Nice J.J. Watt rookie card for Houston. All rookie teams you have at best for Detroit Lions. And look at this Aaron Rodgers. Oh my. Ho. Ho. Big Hit Boulevard. Franchise Fabrics. Aaron Rodgers. Green Bay. Corey. Nice hit in the break, Corey. Man, that's awesome. You don't see a lot of Aaron Rodgers hits coming out of stuff. So that's great. These hits are always way up there. Value. So that's just good stuff, man. We've got one more hit left, and this could be a Todd Heap. Nice canvas card of Heap. Chad Henney, Miami Dolphins, Gridiron Kings. Nice Chad Henney. Number 225. So that was the fourth and final hit there for Corey. Nice going, Corey. So look at all the checklists. I thought I saw Calvin Johnson. But I guess not. Okay, no, I don't see him under rookie materials in there at all. But yeah, a really fun break. Uh so we had some good rookies come out. We saw the JJ uh Watt rookie. That was a great rookie card. J.J. Watt's rookie card. So that was cool. All right. So uh, good stuff, man. That was 2011 uh, Fabrics. 2011 Threads. And we're getting ready for some Bowman 